Let's rank these Zelda games without knowing what comes next. All right, for our very first title, we have Spirit Tracks. You know, Spirit Tracks and Phantom Hourglass are not great. For right now, I actually think I'm going to put it at number five. I feel like there's a lot more winners than losers on this list, so I got to kind of play it safe. All right, our second title is going to be A Link to the Past. That is a classic title, one of the best out there. There's a couple I like a little more. I think I'm going to put it at number two because it's just such an amazing game on such an amazing system that it has to be really high on the list. Our third game is the original Legend of Zelda. It is, in my opinion, a little less great than uh, Link to the Past. So I'm going to actually put it at number three. Breath of the Wild. All right, uh, this is going to be pretty controversial, but I'm actually going to put it at number one. It was really a turning point in the Zelda franchise and really showed the world what this series is capable of. I have to put this at the number one slot. Oracle of Ages and Oracle of Seasons. You know what? Those games are pretty good. They're not amazing, but they are fun, and they were on a good system I like, the Game Boy Color. So I'm pretty happy putting those at four. So there's my ranking for these Zelda games. You know what? Overall, I'm pretty happy, but let me know what you think down in the comments.